Hi everyone, Ronan here and I wanted to create a very quick video on how to install Stalker Anomaly Escape from Pripyat. I'm not going to waste your time to show you exactly how to get up and running with this amazing mod pack. So let's get to it. The first thing that you're going to want to do is go over to the Escape from Pripyat Discord channel. The community here is very helpful. This is where you're going to get all the files needed to install the Escape from Pripyat mod pack. If you go to install EFP version 4, You'll usually end up down at the bottom here. If you scroll up, you'll come to these files here. You're going to want to get the Stalker Anomaly 151 and also the 151 to 152 update. You're then going to want to download Mod Organizer to organize all the mods within the mod pack. 7-Zip is recommended by the mods in the Discord community because there seems to be issues with programs like WinRAR so make sure you get 7-zip to unzip your files and then last but not least choose one of either of these which is the full mod pack so I went for the Google Drive download everything within the Google Drive then you should have a folder like this five important files that you'll need to install the mod pack first thing that you're going to want to do is open up one of your drives I've chosen the D drive here and create folder called EFP also MO2. Now I have it installed already but I'll show you exactly how to do it. The first folder that you're going to open is the EFP and what's going to go into the EFP folder is anomaly 1.5.1.2. If I open that what you're going to do is drag all those files over here. I'm not going to do it because I have it installed already. When that's done it is recommended to launch the Anomaly Launcher. This will launch you into the main menu of Anomaly and then you can instantly quit. The next step is to update Stalker Anomaly to 1.5.2. Going to open that and then we're going to drag all those files into our EFP folder. The next step, and this is a step that I kept getting confused with the game wouldn't launch and I just couldn't understand what was happening. So the EFP version 4.2 I thought went into the MO2 folder. It doesn't. It goes into your EFP folder. So open that up, grab these files and drag into the EFP folder. So in total you have three compressed files that are going into the EFP folder. So the next step is to install the mod organizer. The file that we're going to use for that is mod organizer 2.4.4. We're going to open up our mod organizer folder that we've created. We're going to open up mod organizer 2.4.4 and we're going to drag all of these files into the mod organizer folder. When that's done, we're going to open up our final compressed file, which is EFP version 4.2, MO2001. And we're going to drag all these files into the MO2 folder. To launch the game, we're going to go through the MO2 folder. Scroll down and we're going to select Mod Organizer. You should see this EFP symbol appear. If it doesn't appear, then you've done something wrong and you haven't followed the steps. So I would say delete the files and folders and start again. The very first thing that you're going to do within Mod Organizer is go to the top here, Profile, drop that down and select EFP 4.2. And that will bring up all the mods in Escape from Pripyat. When the profile is selected, we're going to go over here to Run. We can also create a shortcut on our desktop so you don't have to go into Mod Organizer every time that you want to launch the game. And to do that, you would just click shortcut and then put that shortcut on your desktop. But for now, I'm just going to click the run button. It is important that you delete shader cache the very first time that you run the game. So you would select this. I use prefetch sounds as well, and it seems to improve the overall performance of the game. And also shadow map to 1536. Then you're going to click play stalker anomaly. And that will launch the game. If you look down in the bottom here, it shows that you have Escape from Pripyat version 4.2.0.5, which is the latest version. Start a new game and enjoy the absolute amazing mod pack that is Escape from Pripyat. 
if you are playing this game please let me know in the comments section i'd love to hear your experiences and if you want me to go into any more detail let me know as well and i'll try and help you out as best as i can thanks a million for watching the video if i have helped you out please hit the thumbs up please subscribe to the channel we'll see you in the next one